Hello everybody! In this video I will show you how to play flag files on iPhone or iPad, what applications support AVI, MKV, XWID, WMV, 3GP, FLV and other known standard video formats. We will have a look at the most popular programs to play music and video on iOS devices. Dear friends, if you need to recover deleted data, use Utilities by Hetman Software. Follow the link in the description to visit our website, download a utility for free and install it. Then start disk analysis. When the process is over, it will show the files available for recovery, and you will be able to bring them back. Our blog features quick guides to solve all kinds of problems faced by Windows users. Our channel and blog offer solutions for any issues, from installing the operating system to remote administration and connecting mobile devices. Our specialist will be glad to answer your questions in comments to videos and articles. In the previous video, I have already said that the standard audio formats for Apple devices are the following – AAC, HEAAC, MP3, MP3VBR, AC3, EAC3, AAX and AX+, Apple Lossless, AIFF and FAVE. Video formats – AVI, MOV, M4V, compression standards MJPEG, MPEG4 or H.264. Most often, iPhone or iPad users have problems with playing flag audio files. Talking on video files, the number of supported formats is much smaller. The first thing to strike you is no support for MKV and AVI formats iPhone supports only a few formats. If you try loading files in an unsupported audio or video format, it will not be played or even loaded. If you use iTunes to load files, it will refuse to work with such unsupported formats. Users often face this problem trying to load flag audio files that no Apple device can support. You can solve this problem by converting music into a format recognized by iPhone or iPad or by installing an application that can work with such formats. If you know which format your device needs, you can use one of the many converters to work on your audio files. For example, MovaV converter. Find the link in the description. To do it, install the program on your computer and start it. Add the file you want to convert. And select the format for output. Click on the Start button. To save your time from thinking about all of the audio and video formats, some of them certainly not supported by your device, Movavi Converter offers to convert files by device type. For example, if I have iPhone 7 and I need to convert files to be played on it, I add a file to the program, select the tab Devices, Apple, and choose My device from the list. If you don't know your device model, don't worry, the program can recognize it automatically. To enable this option, click on the icon with the magnifying glass and the program will detect devices connected to the computer. As we can see, the device we have selected is now shown in the output format line. That is, all files will be converted into a format compatible with this device. It's very convenient. Click Start, and the flag audio file will be converted into a compatible format. In the same way, you can convert an MKV video file into a format compatible with iPhone or iPad. From App Store, you can also install alternatives to the default audio player. They can play the files in formats incompatible with the Apple standard player. You can choose a player to your taste. Among free products, I'd like to point out some names. Vox. In addition to standard formats, this audio player can work with FLAC, APE, WMA and CUE. FLAC Player Plus. Don't let the FLAC word in the name of this player confuse you. It can work with other formats too, including MP3, AAC, WMA, RM. However, availability of a lossless codec makes it an interesting choice for those who value high-quality sound. You can load music to the library without iTunes as well. 
Having enabled the function of Wi-Fi file transfer for the application, you can follow the link shown in your computer's browser to quickly load audio tracks through the web interface. If you want, you can install alternatives to the standard video player from App Store. You can choose a player to your taste. Among others, I'd like to point out some products. AV Player – It can play video in a huge number of formats, including those unknown to iTunes. AVI, X-Suite, WMV, RMVB, ASF, H.264, MKV, 3GP, FLV. In all resolutions, it supports subtitles in SMI, SRT, TXT and Substation Alpha. However, it is not free. You can download AV Player for iPhone or iPad. Find the links in the description. VLC is the most popular free video player. Many users know it from its desktop version. Traditionally, it supports all necessary formats – AVI, DivX, MKV, WMV, VOB, 3GP, AC3 and many others. VLC can play streaming video and download it from web servers, Wi-Fi, Dropbox, Mega and even Yandex Disk. You can download VLC for iPhone and iPad for free. Find the link in the description. Player Extreme – one more free video player supporting almost all existing video formats. They include 3GP, ASF, AVI, DivX, DV, DAT, FLV, GXF, M2P, M2TS, M2V, M4V, MKV and so on. The player supports HD 1080p in all formats as well as SRT, SSA, ASS, SMI and other subtitle formats in almost all languages. It supports files with several audio tracks. It can increase sound volume when watching films without earphones. But it's not enough to install an alternative video player on your device to play the formats that standard players can't handle. It is because you cannot load FLAC audio files, MKV or AVI video files into iTunes in a standard way. It happens because iTunes and accordingly iPhone or iPad has a common library of files which default applications can access while every third-party application has its own file library. By default, iTunes downloads files in formats compatible with default applications into the common library. That is, to be able to play a file of a different format, you should load it to the library of an application that supports it. How can you do that? Connect your iPhone or iPad to the computer and start iTunes. We showed how to do it in one of our previous videos. Click on the smartphone icon in the left upper corner of the screen. In the window with information on your device that opens, select the menu Programs. Go to the bottom of the screen to Programs – Documents. In order to add a FLAC audio file to iPhone or iPad, click on the audio player that supports this format. After that, in the Documents window, click on Add file and add it to the application library. Ready? Go from the device to the application where the file was added. And you can see the file in its library. In the same way, you can add MKV or AVI video files. If you like this video, click the like button below and subscribe to our channel to see more. Thank you for watching and good luck!